last and final video that I'm going to be doing for the DVD sections thank god though I can finally start watching these these are all um series like seasons and stuff like that so I thought I'll do this for a separate video um I am going to be pausing the video a lot so I can take them off the shelf slowly but surely and if you can see snacks on the side I do apologize but that is for a video that you will see by then that's my dog <laughs> that is a video that you already seen already it's a part is a number two video for Sugarbox UK I do have time this video comes out. I believe the third one might be out, or might just ordered the third one, but we don't know. Um, anyway, let's start off with the first one. And I have Bones. So I have the complete collection. This has 12 episodes, 12 series, sorry, and I love every single one. Bones is literally like, it literally says on the back Bones is a sexed up CSI. That's literally it. So we have someone who deals with bones a lot. Literally, she, her names, her nickname is Bones because she can identify bones simply and easily, and she has a team that does it all. And then we have Booth, who literally is an FBI agent, and he helps her out on cases. And then slowly, slowly, a romance starts. So then we obviously, obviously season two. Cute. Season three, season four, Ouch. then we have season five, season six, season seven, season eight. Season 9, Season 10, Season 11, and of course the last and final season is this one. And this one has how many? 12 episodes, so the last season has gone from 20, 24 episodes to 12 episodes with the last and final season. I actually have only, haven't fully watched the full on Bones, I've only watched two, three seasons I believe. But I know I did, I think I did a video on it where I basically said I read, watched them and said, oh yeah, that was totally good. Yeah, no, um, I just read it offline and basically the episodes what they were going to be around. But yeah, that sounds good. Yeah, that was good. But I doubt it. So that is the complete collection of Bones. So I'm going to move them over to the side so I can get to the next series. One minute. Okay, so the next series is going to be castle so this is castle season one so this has eight seasons and this is of course another criminal kind of um season so this is castle who is a writer and he is helping detective beckett on her cases while writing a story about his books sorry about books about her and then slowly a romance starts to happen and it's so cute i love it they go through so much together and i mean a lot season two Especially when Rich cast, Rich cast, Rich, oh my god, with Castle being rich and anything like that. <laughs> then we have season three, season four, season five, no, season five, <laughs> season six. Number seven. I love this one because they get married. So cute. And then we have season eight, which we go through more intense um, stuff and um, finds before the last and final end of the movie series. Or shall I? I am upset this did end, but eight seasons full of good episodes as well. There's definitely seasons. I have definitely watched every single one of Bones. As well, of Castle. Um, it has cried me. I have cried on it pretty much most of these. I actually love them. So, move on to the next one. 
Okay, so the next seasons, and it's got eight seasons, and no, it's not kind of more investigation one, it is Charmed. I have Charmed season one, so it's about three witches who got finally get together, three sisters get together to be powerful, the Hallowell sisters, and they go for the journey of being magical and learning through magical beasts and creatures and things that should not be existing until each season. So we have season two. I remember actually unboxing these on my monthly hauls in very years ago. I usually cannot believe that. Season three. And as you can see, we are slowly, we see, let's see if I can remember. Piper, Prue, Phoebe. And then, of course, we have a different witch. We have, what's her name? What's her name? Paige. So another P. But obviously, if you see that the person changed, and I was very upset because obviously I've only watched it to four seasons, I believe, of Charmed. I haven't actually fully watched them all. Um, again, exact the same thing again. Um, when I say I haven't like fully watched everything, meaning I have forgotten most of it. So I probably have watched it, just don't can't remember it. Then we have season five. Look at these girls, mate. They're looking hot. Again, then we have six, season six, and then like their hairstyles change. They, they, the way they change in each season is different. Then we have number seven, and then season eight, the last and final season. And this one is yeah. I don't know actually how this is at the end, so we're gonna find out. So that is the last eight seasons of Charmed. I know there's a new series of Chums, but I do not want to watch that. I don't like the remake of it. Um, I'm going to keep to my original version. Move on on to the next series. Okay, so sorry about that. My camera decides to die on me. So this is a, going to add into the first video. I don't know how it died. It was literally like 50%. Okay. <laughs> anyway, so the next series is going to be Critical Minds. So we have the first season. I have not watched any of these yet, and um, literally can't wait. The way to a criminal is through his mind or her mind. Not all criminals are men. So there's that one. Then we have is season two. So it says on here, for these FBI agents, danger lurks inside. So we meet some, like I watched the first episode on YouTube, and I was so intrigued by. It. I was like, oh, what is this? Then we have season four, which, sorry, season three. It says, let the mind games begin. Then we have season four. This has focus on the criminal, not the crime. Me, the criminal, not the thing. Then we have season five. What they would do blow you away, how they do it will blow your mind. Then we have season six. The FBI sharpest thinkers have murder on their minds. We have the seventh, seventh season, Evil is a State of Mind. We have the eighth, uh, Dark Crimes are Brilliant Solutions. Number nine, Unlock the Mind, Unlock the Truth. Number ten, Trace the Mind, Crack the Crime. So for some reason, I didn't get season 11. Season 11, they sent me season nine when the picture definitely said season 11 which I now have to contact them to let them know that they sent me a season 9 and not a season 10, sorry, a season 11, and I have to show them the whole set. Yay. Then I have got season 12, which is says Think Dark Thoughts. Then season 13, which is something, there's no nothing on that one. And then season 14, which has nothing on this one either. Isn't it, I thought there's season 15. I don't know how many seasons there are this. I think it's still continuing. Or this fifth, season 15 is the last one of season 14. I'm not actually quite sure. But that is the next season. It's done. Kind of my mind. I cannot wait to watch them. So, and I'll move on. Okay, moving on. We have the CSI, um, Crime Scene Investigation. We have 15 seasons. Let's go to this one. So, of course, we have season one. So, this is like where they, they have their teams. They have their, like, the night crime night time crew, uh, crew and with their crew as well um they go through different investigations so two people go for a certain one and then the other two will go for a main one so we find out more serial killer stuff 
and other things like that so i do love this and it has 23 episodes too then we have season two and we have csi season three part one and season three part two season four part one season four part two season five part one season five part two season six part one season six part two season seven part one season seven part two season eight part one season two part two so i could not find them in those ones i could not find them in any of the series i could literally not find them anywhere so i had to put doing part one part two but then i found the complete collection of season nine but we our characters slowly move because then we have season 10 we're like oh Grissom's not in it anymore season 11 season 12 oh he's not in there anymore i can't remember his name but he's not in it anymore because a tragic thing happened then we have a season 13 season 14 and then season 15 so this ends in 18 episodes so from 23 24 to 23 something like that to 18 episodes i do like how the last seasons are always the um less episodes but i would like to have i wish i had the kind of similar episodes where they'll kind of solve the last seasons just like trying to solve the big cases like the big cases and i feel like that but that is all 15 seasons of the csi Okay, so our next series is going to be CSI Miami. So this is uh, part one. So obviously, same like CSI uh, Crime Scene Investigation, this is about stuff in the Miami that happens. And there's a lot of crimes that happen in that one. So that's part one. We have part two. We have season one, part season two, part one, and part two. And Speed is still in it. Then we obviously have season three, part one and part two. And this one's upsetting because stuff happens in this one. No, it's the last episode in season two. Don't like how the main character ends up leaving in the, like the second season or something like that. And they must have something different to go to. Then we have season four, part one and part two. Season five, part one and part two. season six part one and part two so csi has 10 seasons by the way here's the season seven and now i've got the full collection of this one we have season eight season nine and season ten that's all csi miami pretty much there's a lot of seasons going on with CSI and those crime scene investigation ones, so I'm really excited to be honest. But yeah, let's move on because I've still got those to go through. Okay, next up we have is CSI New York, and it has a nine seasons. So we have season one, so if it's exactly the same like Miami and CSI, this is just based in New York. We have the season two. Then we have is season three, part one and part two. We have season four, part one and part two. And we have season five, part one and part two. Then these are all back to four series again. So we have season six, season seven, season eight, and season nine. So this next, like, this next one, it's only got one season so far because I just watched it um and well i couldn't i couldn't put it down i want to know what the season was about and that is csi vegas season one this whole series season was literally about um oh my god what is his name hoddins they were trying to find out who was trying to frame him because he took evidence out of apparently he took loads of evidence out to create his own like rec like reprint stuff and so they could be framing other people framing the same person who's maybe died already or um being in prison already trying to get back in for revenge but it seems someone's doing the exact same thing to him 
and this 10 episodes i believe uh doesn't even say to be honest i think it was 10 episodes um of it literally of them just trying to find out who was trying to basically frame hodgins i was like oh it, okay this is interesting so it's literally just about one crime and i do like that about seasons where they do focus on one crime and um, while they are trying to solve other crimes too but this is pretty good so i cannot wait to find out what season two is going to be about and um, that was next then next pile we're going to go to that one okay that got dark real quick sorry my um the weather changed quite quickly it's too nice sunny day two looks like it's about to piss it down and I filmed this quite early anyway. So the next series at the moment it has six seasons. It might have more by the time I have finished. If, time I actually upload this. So if you see more seasons then at the end of the video you know. Um, so we have DC Legends of Tomorrow. This is season one. We have season two. Season three. Season four. Uh, season five and then you have season six so with these as well um it is quite interesting to see how they come through and also we have like people from the arrow flash and so on like that from different areas from D different dc worlds and uh, they combine together to go to different eras and save people basically it's such a weird complex one but i was like okay i've only watched the first season guys i have no other one but i really like the first season how it was complex to it so i cannot wait to find out what the other five seasons are about i think there's a season seven but i'm not actually quite sure who knows but six seasons of dc and dc's legends of tomorrow oof so many more to go okay next up we have six seasons of grim so I wouldn't have thought I would like this, but I was like, okay, this is like grim with, because the first episode was literally about Red Riding Hood, pretty much, and find out he was a grim. I was like, hell yeah, that sounds interesting. So it's not something I would go for, but I was like, you know what, I'm going to go for it. Then we have is season two, season three, where he's more friends with some of the creatures. And he's not like all the other Grims who just kill on sight, pretty much. He's a different type of Grim. And I think it's cool. Then we have season four. Season five. And season six. But when he basically looks at someone and they will turn themselves into the monster form. That their face will go shift. And then he's like, you're Grim, bitch. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kill you. Unless they're a good person, then they're fine. But, Jesus, we have so much to deal with. <laughs> but let's go. So next up we have for three seasons, because um, I don't know if there's any more coming out. And that is going to be Legacy. So this is actually vampires between the originals, the vampire diaries. And I think there's something else in there. The originals kept, yeah, no, it's literally them. Yeah, so between those two stories, these are their kids, basically. This is all about their kids. I was like, what? Okay. Then I have season two and season three. So I got this all in a box set, um, like for 30 quid, I think. No, I got it down quite low, actually. It was supposed to be 30 quid, but I got it down quite low because each season costs about 20 quid or maybe more. Like season three is like 50 quid. And I'm like, mm, that's expensive. Oh, no. So, I'm sorry, I had to pause my, my thing because um, it came onto a video and I was like, oh no, I need to watch that. First three, first three seasons of that. I'm not going to pause this one because it's only three episodes. So we can just move on to the next one. So I have the first of four seasons of Luf, 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 Lucifer. Lucifer. It takes me a minute, give me a chance. So I have watched a few season, episodes of this and I just love it. Demon. Yes, please. I want to know more and it's, it's literally like crimes as well so a demon comes in to help a police officer solve crimes what season two season three and season four 
So I know this is season five, but at the moment it's at 25 quid. No, thank you. Do not want that. No, no, no. You know. Then I have the first two seasons of Miraculous Ladybug. So we have season one and season two. So I was like quite surprised when I found these on eBay. I was like, wait, what? They have them actually on series? Uh, yes, please. So I do have some movies. Uh, just need to find out when they do season three and season four, I think. I think they're doing season five. Not sure. Then I have the nine seasons. You might just saw a clip of it. Nine seasons of My Little Pony. Like I said, I'm still a child. Leave me alone. So I have the first season of episode, season one of My Little Pony. With Twilight learning to be friends with other people. Then we have season two. I've only watched two season two. I have not watched any of these other ones. At all. Season three. Season four. Season five. Season six. Season seven. Season eight. And then season nine. I don't think there's any other series than these. But as you can see, the um, I feel like the um, characters get a bit more different, except from Rainbow Dash. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's all those series. And then we're going to move on to the next one, which is this pile right here, by the way, guys. Okay, so the next pile, or next seasons, we have 18 seasons of NCIS. Now, I do find out there is a 19th season, but I'm not paying 20 quid for it, so I'm going to wait until it goes down a bit more, because time I get to NCSI, um, it'll probably be, like, something. So, let's get through them. So, we have season one. Season two. Season three. Season four. Season five. Season 6, Season 7, Season 8, Season 9, Season 10, then we have Season 11, Season 12, I almost forgot what I was about to say then. Then we have season 13. We have season 14. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know why I just crashed on that one. Then we have season 15. So from season 15 onwards, I have not watched. That is it. Oh, I do know that there is some stuff. That I did not expect, and I was like, oh, thanks for that. So anyway, season 16. Season 17. And then we have season 18. So season 19 is on its way, and I think season 19 might be the last season of NCIS. If so, that'd be lovely. That'd be 19 great seasons of NCIS. I absolutely love the series. Love the whole concept of it as well. Let's move on to the next series. One second. Okay, so next up we have is NCSI, NCIS, Los Angeles, and that has 12 seasons. So I believe they actually do have a 13 series as well, and I'm just waiting for that to come on sale. Sorry, I'm really making these really wobbly, but hey ho. So we have season one. I've actually only watched the first season of this series. Have not watched it and any of them all. Every time I go, right, I'm going to watch every single season. Um, all my DVDs, I don't. I just give up halfway. I'm like, eh, it's fine. But I need to be conscious, I need to focus on it more because I need to be like, right, I need to know what I'm doing. I need to watch stuff because then I can understand and talk about it more to you guys, right? So then we have season two. Season three. Season four. Yes, that is L. That's my, uh, that's new, my alarm. Telling me to wake up even though I've been up since half seven this morning. So we have season four, season five, season six, season seven, season eight, 
season nine, season 10, season 11, and lastly, season 12. So 12 seasons of NCIS Los Angeles. And like I said, I've only watched the season one so far. I have not watched the rest. So I need to focus on more watching those. Okay, next set. Okay, so the next series only has seven seasons and that is going to be NCIS New Orleans. Oh, is it raining? It looks like it might have started raining, so it's still going to stay dark. Yes. Anyway, so you've got season one and I've only watched this season at all. That is all I have watched, no other seasons. So I need to catch up with my seasons, a lot of them, and I've got to hear for it. So we have season two, so this is everything crime in New, Lo New Orleans. So apparently they're doing a Hawaii one, but I think they stopped because of the weather or something, or the COVID, anything like that. So season four, season five, season six, and season seven, the last and final season. Let the good times roll one last time. Do, 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 do. 16 episodes that is exciting though okay so why i'm on here because i um, might as well because i'm not gonna add to the pile the next seasons are going to be the seven seasons of all and that's just going to be once upon a time this is a series about disney movies basically all the disney people and like wizard of oz all the creatures, all the stories you would know is in this, and I freaking love it. That's all I'm going to say. We have season two, season three, and this, I think this is season three, the one that I like, because it's got Peter Pan in it, and um, Peter Pan is like my one of my favourite Disney movies, and the gardener's heart. <laughs> then we have season four, which is like more Frozen kind of style. We have season five. Season 6 and Season 7. So it's really weird because Season 7 turns out to be like Season 1 where Henry is older and he forgets who what everything that has happened in those six seasons until he, um, his daughter comes out and finds out that he goes, are you blah blah? Because this is exactly what happened to him when he was finding his mum that um, his daughter came to find him to come take, her, take him back to storybook i was like what a twist did not expect that to come in me <sighs> okay so <laughs> next season it's got seven seasons <clears throat> and that's going to be pretty little liars and funny enough i've only watched it to the second season so i need to get myself watching mate don't i i'm so behind of everything Season three, season four, wait, go back that side. Season five, season six, and season seven. So their costumes are a bit hyped up in it. So yeah, I have pretty much watched only two seasons. So yeah, oopsies. He 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 he. But um, yeah. Let's um, move these down and then get to the last final finals. You probably can see sneak peeks of them anyway. Okay, so the first set we have got is the Shadow Hunters. The first, the, sorry, the um, three seasons. So we have season one, season two, and season three. All seasons. I even caught the movie, and I love the movie. Um, and then obviously. Season 3 Shadow Hunters. I know everyone doesn't like the Shadow Hunters uh, verse, but I really like it. I don't know what anyone's on about. It's a good thing. So next up we have 15 seasons of Supernatural. So again, I wouldn't thought I would go for this because I'm not a big fan of kind of this, but when I heard about Supernatural, I was like, oh my god, I love these two brothers basically doing the family business. Yeah. And I actually really, really enjoyed watching this. Just the, just the humour and the... I thought it was going to sneeze, but I yawned. But just, I love it. So we have season one, part one and part two. 
we have season two, part one and part two, of course. Then I have the complete collection of season three. Um, season four. Season five. Season six. I have season seven. Season eight. Season nine. And season 10. Then we have is season 11, season 12, and uh, I've also forgot, guys, I've only watched it to season 3 of Supernatural because I was waiting until all 15 seasons come out. Um, so I was waiting until the like complete collection of season because I want to try and see if I can just bin watch it all. So now I can finally watch it all. It's like a lot of these I'm like, oops, I haven't done yet. So then we have season 13. Season 14, and then lastly season 15, which is the final season. This was so upsetting. And there's a lot that goes on this. It makes me sad every time. Okay, so next up we have is six seasons of Team Wolf. So this is the first two seasons in one box set, which I love. So season one and season two. We have season three, part part one, then season three, part two, season four, part four. I like the one, is it this one or is it season three? I think it's season three. Yeah, season three is when um, Styles become evil. Now that's a trip and a hazard. I was like, oh, hello. So we have Team Wolf season one, season five, part one. We have part two. Then we have season six, part one. And season six, part two. So I just found out recently that they did, they have doing, well, they have just finished, I believe, the Team Wolf movie. And I cannot wait, guys. Literally cannot wait. Anyway, so the next one, we have the complete series in one box set, five seasons of the originals. So now I get to finally know more about the originals. So they said you should watch um, in between all the originals and the Vampire Diaries, so you can kind of get in between them. But for me, I'm not going to do that. Because I'm lazy and I can't be able to keep switching in and out the DVDs for each season. And the last and final season that we have is Vampire Diaries. Vampire Diary Season 1, Season 2, Season 3, Season 4. So that's where I've got you guys, Season 4. That is it. Season 5, Season 6, Season 7, and Season 8 of the final season. And that is all the episodes we have. Literally. I think I am planning to delete some videos as well, though. But that is all the dis all the dis series. That is literally all the series I have. Um, so now all of I've got a few other bits I need to film, but I'll do that later in more of the when it gets close to December. I just wanted um to get these down and hopefully be able to start watching these very soon, so I'll be able to do my DVD TBR basically for you guys so you can see what i've watched that sounds in for me it sounds interesting and i only came up with it literally the other day someone might have done it already but i have never seen it but yeah there we go guys i hope you guys enjoy and i will see you guys next time and of course like i say every second time if there is any um series that you see at the end of this video then obviously i've added them on but you know i've now got to work out each video nice but that is it and i'll see you guys next time peace bye <coughs> Yo, <clears throat> yeah, you can see five videos of me like this. So the next one is um, the series one. So obviously, as you can see behind me, we have my criminal mind. So obviously, I just waited on one more season, and that is season eleven. So now I can finally watch the whole se whole season, fourteen seasons. 
yeah, 14 seasons of Criminal Minds. I am getting, I, when I found this out and I watched the first episode, I was like, hell yeah, I want that because I want to know more. So I finally got Criminal Minds. Season 11, so I cannot wait to watch this. Um, so yeah. Series. I don't know what else you want me to do, guys. Just, yeah. There's going to be a lot of videos like this. I'm only ready to do this when I can film, basically. When I can film, it could be bigger piles or it could be small piles like this. So bear with me, okay, guys? I'll see you for the next part. <laughs> and here we go again. So next up we have is our series. Our series times. So we have NCSI Season 13 of Los Angeles. I cannot wait to watch these right now. I'm so stoked for these. Then we have is Lucifer Season 5. And actually, when I'm filming this, I'm actually currently watching Lucifer Season 1. So now I can add this to the list. Same with Season 6 of Lucifer. Apparently we still have to see this the last season. Not sure on. And then we have is Season 19 of NCSI, which is actually crazy. And I cannot believe how many seasons this show is keep going. And apparently it's Season 20. So I do plan to get NCSI Hawaii, guys, when it's the full set swing. And then lastly, I have Flash Season 8. Woohoo. So that is all the seasons I have and did purchase myself. Um, so yeah, all the stuff I need to get through. Um, so yeah, that's everything.